when I looked at our society and I see this picture, this painting, being worth more than a thousand of these houses fully equipped, then I got not only confused but furious. How can this kind of painting, whatever that is, be as valuable as thousands of houses with all of the equipment in those houses? How can this be true? Who says that this painting is more valuable? Who puts value on our stuff, maybe on our lives? In the present it's not uh, anymore about, uh, you know, you have a cow, you can raise cows and, uh, you know, I need food. So can you give me that and I'll build a house for you? It's not at all like that. It's all about uh, chasing the money, chasing this rocket that left Earth, that left reality. Humans chase that rocket, basically that's how it is. It's kind of detached because uh, if you think about how do we put uh, value on the stuff today? Going back to that painting, uh, why is it more valuable than a thousand? of those big, big houses. All is just because, just because human beings completely derailed from reality and then just put prices arbitrarily on stuff, you know. That's how it is. What is the price of a tree? What is the price of uh, nature when it's in good conditions and it allows us to live better? What's the price of climate change? What's the price of a river? What's the price of not like a fish in the market, but the population of fish? Know, the survival of some species. What's the price of happiness? What's the price of a family? What's the price of your parents? What's the price of you know things that matter? We don't put prices on these things. We only put prices on things that we can sell. It can be as ridiculous as that painting being more valuable than uh, so many other important and useful things. That painting has more value than other human beings have in this world. Actually, many of them. With the value of that painting, you can probably get food and save millions of human beings from dying of starvation. That's how insane we have become.